Uh, wow. So you must have won good in Vegas. Carmen, I did pretty well. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, and you're just throwing away Gucci I mean, bags. That was an expensive I football mean, game. <laughs> do you want to hear the story or do you oh, want to hear the story? Yeah. <laughs> so I showed some of my winnings. I showed. Uh, well, you know, the best part was your son first pull thousand dollars. First pull thousand dollars. <laughs> so mad that he lost it all. Yeah. Oh. So my son sits Welcome down yep. at, uh, the, at a slot machine in like three pulls, thousand dollars. He, I, I call. I go, where are you? And he goes, I'm over here. The, and I pointed out the machine he should use. Right. I go, use one of those. I go, don't use any of those over there. And uh, so he wins, and he's super excited and everything. And I go, listen. I go. It's your money. Do whatever you want. I go, do you want me to give me some? I said, you know, give me like $700. You take $300, do whatever you want with it or go buy something, whatever. No, I'm good. I'm not giving it back. You know, that's not everything. Mm. So of course, like a couple days later, you can't win on the first day. No. You know what I mean? So he chased that. I came in and my wife's laughing. She goes, you want to tell dad why you're so bad? No. And, I go, and I told him, I go, listen, everybody <laughs> does it. I go, I know it's not going to make you feel any better, but that's how it goes. I mean, man, that's the thing. Yeah. If you win the first day, the first poll, you're done. Just go yeah. buy. Just yeah. go Buy a Gucci bag right away. Yeah. Yeah. That was Joey. We went to uh, Hard Rock and he was playing slots. And in the first like half hour, he hit for like uh, thirteen hundred dollars. And then he's like, "All right, I'm leaving." And we're like, "What do you? What do you mean you're leaving?" He goes, "I, I just won. I don't know. I gotta go." And he just took his money and left. I went, "All right, that's the way. That's to go. the way yeah. you do it. That's yeah. the way you do it." But uh, you know, most people can't do that. Yeah, but he was like, "I don't know." He goes, "What do I do with it?" I go, "The money." I go, "Give it back. Start paying me back all the money." Yeah. I yeah. You. What do so, you mean? What do you do with it? Go put it in the bank. So I was doing pretty good three par- three card poker. Uh, I did well with blackjack and stuff. And then I asked him, "I go, do you guys have any double deck dealt?" blackjack whatever no but we do have double deck and it's in the mansion and i go what is the mansion mansion? the mansion is the high limit room so i go "Ooh, let me check out the mansion i go over to the mansion lowest table three hundred dollars a hand i go well you're in vegas Mm -hmm. let's do this so i took out five grand (laughs) and you went went to the mansion went to the mansion and i was playing and i was doing pretty well and then they brought in the Asian guy. Wang. Oh, the green cool. Wang. Wearing a full tuxedo. Hello, sir. Oh, I'm doing this. First hand, blackjack. I go, Wang, you're pretty cool. Oh. I like you. <laughs> so now Wang's in the game. Opposite <laughs> of what Pete would say. Pete would wrap it up when they bring the Wang in. Uh, $300 minimum per hand. Betting $100 now for Wang also. He's in the game because... He won me a blackjack on the first one. You're giving Wang a hundred dollars. Hundred dollars. Oh, you're like Sarasani with pumpkins, mm-hmm. not in Gen Pop. So we start going, <laughs> and I'm winning, and now I'm varying my bets between three hundred and a thousand dollars per oh, hand. Who are, are you? you? Per hand. Who are you? I'm in Vegas. <laughs> I'm in the yeah. mansion. At any point, did you think I should quit my job and become a professional gambler? <laughs> well, this is now one down. <laughs> I should just live here now. So I'm up pretty good now. Give me an idea. I'm up right now about ten grand. Okay, and I put out a thousand dollars on the hand. I get dealt two eights against the dealer six. Oh, if you know oh. blackjack, mm-hmm. always split eights, mm-hmm. especially against the six. So I split my eights. So now I have two thousand dollars out there. He's telling me you got oh. twos. I get a three, so it's eleven. Uh. So that's a double down. So I double down on that. Mm-hmm. I get a nine, which is twenty. Next one, I get a two on your eight on my eight. So that's another double down because it's ten against a so six. So how much is this out there now? So now it's three. So now it's four thousand oh, out there. <laughs> oh so I God. double down. Are you crapping? Yeah, inside. It doesn't inside. If you have all the money in the world, right. you're still crapping when you got four thousand dollars out on the table. Inside, I'm crapping, but outside, I'm trying to look as cool as possible. I'm probably going. <laughs> <laughs> I, but I, in my mind, I think that I'm James Bond at the yeah, table yeah. with the guy whose blood is coming out of his eye. It's yeah. not even its not even my money, and it's giving me anxiety right, right, right now. Right. So I get a two, so I have a ten against a six. So I double down, and I get a three. And I go, oh, God, so I have 13 against a six, so I have to stay on Stay, that. yeah. So I stay on that. He has a six. He flips over a ten. He has 16. So far, so, so good. So he has to hit again. He flips it over, so now I have 20 here. I have 13 here. He has 16. Flips over the next card. Five. He goes 10, 10. Oh. I win the whole thing. Oh. Eight grand on one hand. Oh, my God. 
God. I am up 14,000 or something, whatever. And uh, because I played back down a little bit, I went up and then I played back down to 14,000. I said, bye. Yeah. And this is why you move good for you. Go get another Gucci bag. Yeah. Go get another Gucci bag. Who cares? Oh, just Gucci. Dude, I walked out of there shaking. I was vibrating. I was like, what is going on? Are you wearing a uh, Queens of the Stone Age t shirt while you're in there? Yes, 100%. Oh, Oh, dude. Every time I walked in there, I was wearing running shorts with my bright socks Uh, and an (laughs) electric wizard t shirt (laughs) and my hat on backwards. And they go, "Uh, Uh, hey, buddy, uh, the $5 tables are over there. You know what I mean? And I sat down and I just did it. I was like, oh, this is. Were there other people at the table? No, nobody else at the table. So with the mansion, the thing about that is they have reserved tables there and then they have the high limit, all the different stuff. At any point that I was in there, which I went in there a couple times, whatever, just to look around before there was three other people in there, wow. maybe. Wow. And at the tables, the dealers were just waiting for somebody to come yeah. in and do something. Yeah. And then they had the, uh, they had the Baccarat back in the back over there, which I walked through there all high limit, yeah. crazy, yeah. crazy back there. Yeah. But oh, yeah, that's so, fun, dude. That's uh, fun when it ends good. But I was like, you know what? This is the time. This is the time to do it. I'm going to go crazy. I'm going to have fun with it. You know, because normally if I go over to Hard Rock, I'll bring, you know, grand, maybe two, right, right. you know, in bet decent, whatever, but not like that. That was wow. uh, Nana. We went during the hurricane. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. I text Mike and he was like, I'm heading over to Hard Rock. I go, are you really? Because we, I mean, we had nothing not? to do. We had Why no not? power. We we're like, let's go to the Hard Rock. So yeah. we did. And it was, uh, it was good. It was fun.